In the mid-1800s Belgian scientist, Adolphe Catelet, developed the Catelet Index, which is known today as the Body Mass Index, BMI. This statistical measurement compares a person's height and weight, and is a full tool to identify weight problems within a population or for an individual. Though a BMI calculator cannot measure the actual percentage of body fat, its ease of calculation makes it a popular diagnostic tool for health experts. The body mass index is defined as an individual's body weight in kilograms divided by the height in meters squared. Body mass index was always intended to be a general guide for health professionals. However, doctors must consider other factors on a case-by-case -case basis. For example, muscle density, bone density, and ethnic origin can skew the results of a BMI calculator. For a general guideline, the body mass index is broken into separate categories corresponding to the BMI. Severely underweight equals less than 16.5. Underweight equals 16.5 to 18.5. Normal equals 18.5 to 25. Overweight equals 25 to 30. Obese class 1 equals 30 to 35. Obese class 2 equals 35 to 40. Obese class 3 equals over 40. Using the BMI calculator, a health and nutrition survey in 1994 found that 59% of American men and 49% of women have a body mass index over 25. Individuals with a BMI higher than 40 are considered morbidly obese, which accounts for 2% of the men and 4% of the women in America. A more recent survey in 2007 shows an increase in America's weight, with 63% of Americans considered overweight and 26% in the obese category. For individuals who are underweight, a BMI close to 15 is an indicator of starvation, and 17.5 is an informal indicator of eating disorders such as anorexia nervosa. It is very common to consider the BMI calculator in the medical underwriting of private health insurance plans. Providers will use a high BMI as a cutoff point to raise insurance rates or deny coverage. Furthermore, the BMI is often used by surgeons to determine if a patient qualifies the gastric pan procedure. Typically, doctors are looking for a BMI of 35 or higher when considering potential candidates. Each case should be considered on an individual basis, but the BMI calculator does serve as a handy tool. A simple explanation of the BMI calculator by Jeff Lord, sponsored by gastricbandingsurgery.co.uk. You can visit our website at www.gastric-banding-surgery.co.uk